After narrowly qualifying to the World Cup in Qatar ahead of the Super Eagles of Nigeria, I really didn't see anything spectacular the Black Stars of Ghana could do at the World Cup. But something magically changed in my mind as I was watching the last 20 minutes of the Portugal-Ghana game. I saw the fearlessness of the Black Stars stronger than that of the Saudis against the Argentinians. Like just imagine if Inaki Williams scored that last 9 minutes goal. Like that would have been a historical highlight. By the time of writing this script, Ghana just took a slim 3-2 loss against CR7 Portugal. And most people think Ghana is taking the next available flight back to Accra. But trust me when I say this, they won't. I see Ghana taking a step further than what they did at the 2010 South African World Cup, and that's fact. So join me as we take a good look at Ghana's chances at the World Cup in Qatar. Well, guys, if you're new here, please like this video, share, subscribe, like this video, share, subscribe. It really doesn't mean anything to you, but it actually does to me, like it means a big deal to me. So let's get right into the video. First off, I would love to say this, the penalty I ordered to Ronaldo wasn't worth it and that's a fact. Secondly and most importantly, Mohamed Kudus was graced with throughout his whole time on the pitch against the Portuguese. I mean everybody have been seeing his prolificness and impact in the Ajax team, notably in the Champions League with 10 goals in 21 games this season for Ajax. That form have also been reflected in the national team. Even though Ghana currently sit at the bottom of the group, it's really possible for them to qualify regardless of what you might be thinking. They have the same level of squad depth and talent with the rest of the team in the group apart from Portugal of course. I must commend the coach Otto Ado for a good job done and a fluid 5-3-2 formation but also advise him to come out and play the same way he did in the last 20 minutes of the game against Portugal without making much changes to the current squad or the current starters. I also advise the team to be fearless like the Saudis, be strategic and tactical like the Europeans, be talented like the Brazilians. But don't forget one thing, don't forget to be original like a black man and definitely you move out of the group stage and that's just the truth. Cause the black stars of Ghana have a statement to make at this World Cup, they are underestimated and they are the lowest ranked team in the World Cup but they already have two goals to their credit. Why do you think they can't get out of the group? Don't underestimate the black stars of Ghana and always remember this, anything is possible in the game of football. Football is an even game. Well guys, I'm all out and I really appreciate you for tuning into this video. Please like, share, subscribe, just leave a comment. Thank you very much and thank you very, very, very much. I appreciate, I really appreciate. Like, share, subscribe and let's get right into the next video.